People often shit themselves when they die. Their muscles slack, their souls flutter free and everything else just slips out. The playwrights seldom mention when our hero breathes his loss in his heroine's arms. They call no attention to the stain spreading across his tights. Be advised that this tale shares no such restraints. This tale speaks of a girl who was to murder as maestros are to music, who did to happily ever afters what a saw blade does to skin. She's dead herself now, a republic in ashes behind her. A city of bones and bridges laid at the bottom of the sea by her hand. A girl some call pale daughter, or kingmaker, or crow. Never flinch, never fear, never forget.
Why didn't you tell me? I wanted to know what it felt like. In case I die. Now I know. Didn't die, I see. Not for lack of trying. I won't see you for a long time, will I? I might never see you again. You know this. You chose this. I'm not sure there was ever really a choice. It seems the hangman lost a few before I got to him. They'll understand. Be at the 17th pier by six bells. Look for Trelane's bow. She's a free ship, not flying I train flags. Captained by a fellow named Wolfeater. She sails for last hope. No way you can follow then. I've trained you well. You're the greatest pupil I've ever sent into the mother's service. Spread your wings and fly in that place. You burned it. Should I name it? All great blades seem to have names. Naming your blade is a sort of shit reserved for heroes. Men who have songs written for them, histories spun for them. It's the shadow road for you and me. And if you dance it right, no one will ever know your name, let alone the blade in your belt. You'll be a rumor, a whisper. The thought that wakes the bastards of this world sweating in the never night. I'll miss you. The last thing that you'll ever be in this world, girl, is someone's hero. But you will be a girl. Hero is fear.